Mm-hmm. So what is your vision of a modern day parliament for a modern day parliament is where you know each component part will have a role to play. You, know? you will you have seen it you know, um, how the anti fake news amendment you know, was not v- voted on you know, in, in, in favor favorably by the Senate. And that's democracy. That's modern day parliament. Yeah, um, you have seen the debates. You've seen the white paper on Felda. You've seen the. Dis- the discussions around the white paper, the presentation of midterm review, and that's modern day parliament, you know. But w- the spoiler comes in when there is unparliamentary behaviour. So all the good points are overshadowed by this unparliamentary behaviour. There's so many good points which are raised, you know, in the course of uh, question time, in the course of debates, yeah, and through committees. Um, from both sides of the divide, from the opposition who were previously in government and from government who were previously the opposition. A very good set of ministers, yeah? uh, they present their arguments well. Yeah? Uh, we have a very good set of backbenchers on the opposition who have the experience of being former ministers or deputy ministers. You know? They also have very good points to, to give, uh, but if everyone behaves that way, then we will move very fast to attain you know, the international benchmark of a good, responsible parliament. Specifically, yeah. what kind of mindsets do you want to see our parliamentarians have? A mindset, very simply, a mindset that knows what parliament stands for, <laughs> you know, and how you should behave as a parliamentarian. Is that mindset yeah. very low? For some, for some, yeah, either they don't know it or they purposely don't want to follow. What, what is uh, unparliamentary behaviour? Shouting obscenities, calling other people's name, bringing in ceramah issues uh, as part of a debate. What is ceramah? Uh, what is a ceramah issue? Should be kept at the door. You can say anything you want when you're presenting something the, uh, during a ceramah, but when you are in the when you're in parliament, uh, surely, you know, parliamentary behaviour calls for something more substantive. You're people's representatives, man. Right? You have to fight for, for the rakyat. You have to present views that reflect the wishes of the rakyat. You know, you're not asking for people to vote you in again. You're there already. So, Chirama issues should be kept as Chirama issues. You know, and when you are in parliament, you discuss issues based on facts and figures and statistics and logical arguments and intellect, huh? not calling each other the names. So there's too, too much rhetoric. Yeah. A lot of rhetoric. Yeah, and rhetoric huh? and political positioning. That is not parliament. 